So right now we are radiating left or right um, from my antennas. They're directional. Um, and like I say, right now we're ra ra radiating this way and that way, out that side of the vehicle. Uh, but the idea is to get them that way, heading out the front of the vehicle. So that's what we're going to be working on right now. Now first, what we'll want to do is figure out which direction our signal is going. And to figure that out, that's what this little guy's for. Not only is it good for setting your SWR, but you ever see on the back we got this little antenna here. Well, guess what that's for? Hmm, we're gonna find out. Get that little guy off there, just pop it right in there. Okay, once we have this little guy ready to uh, do some field strength testing, what we want to do is make sure we got no power running out your on your uh, your system. You want to be just the radio with no heat. What you're going to do is what we're going to do is we're going to key this thing down and then go around the outside of the vehicle and measure with this thing the difference in strength as we move around the vehicle. Okay, so here we go. What we're going to do, turn on the radio, get our mic here, I'm just going to key it, again, no power, I'm just going to key it, put it down there in between the seats so it stays keyed. Okay, so the mic's keyed down, let's take this little guy here and see what it says. So what I want to do is I'm going to stay, try to stay up even with the hood of the roof of the vehicle there. And right there we're getting a reading, sorry, of 1.5. Okay, let's go around to the front. We have a reading of about one and a quarter. So we're definitely getting more signal out of the side than we are out the front. Okay, after about making 150 adjustments to this rear antenna here, uh, we are good to go. What I did was I brought that um, Micronta out to about here, pulled a measurement, went out to the round of the front of the vehicle, Quarter measurement holding that thing up in the air roughly about the same distance from the vehicle as close as possible because uh, that distance does make a big difference also if you can see I came somewhere with nothing around I'm out here with very little in the area because when you're making these measurements anything and everything that's close by will affect it um, so, just an example, I'm over at my friend, uh, friend's house getting the SWR set on that center antenna and he has his antenna analyzer hooked up to it because uh, those things are about a million times easier to use than one of those little SWR meters. But um, he has his antenna analyzer hooked up to it and we're getting the SWR set on that center antenna and as vehicles drive past we can watch that SWR needle drop as the vehicle's next to us and then when the vehicle drives past more, the SWR needle comes back up. So that's just to give you an example of how environmental factors can affect those readings substantially. So it makes a great deal of sense to try to get out where there's very little around you to affect those measurements. 